Yo, what's going on you guys? It's your boy Jeremy Cash, live and direct with another valuable video for you. Today's video is going to be CPA versus Forex. This is a subscriber's request. They wanted to know with a $135 investment, what's better? Okay, guys. Now, there's a lot of things you got to factor in uh, to this to kind of determine that. So let's get into it. All right, so some of the things to factor in is how much time is going to take for me to make money, how much effort do I have to put in, what's the thought process, how fast can I get a return, and what's the long-term goal, guys, okay? So these are some of the things that you guys have to factor in. So as far as how much time uh, I'm going to have to put in, so with CPA, uh, you're going to have to put in you know some work as well as forex uh you kind of got to learn the charts uh and forex and then with cpa you got to learn uh, a lot of things as well right so how much effort would i have to put in so as far as cpa let's go cpa with cpa you have to learn you know the effort as far as you know your landing pages is it a good landing page so for instance let's say you put in you know 135 dollars into a facebook ad right and you have to you know then you have to split test so you're going to be kind of throwing money out and wasting money at the beginning because you have to see you know what landing page is doing good what landing page is not doing good you know should i put a uh you know uh, a capture page uh should i capture the email or should i not uh is the wording right uh or the colors right because all this kind of stuff plays a believe it or not plays a factor uh, into into as far as as much effort as you're gonna put into this campaign uh, with the hundred and thirty five dollars, right? And so on the thought process as far as effort and the uh, forex market, you're looking at you know uh, where where's the trend going? Um, you know is the trend a uptrend or is it a downtrend, right? Uh, and some other things that you have to factor in as far as that. Now the thought process. You know as far as forex goes so i'm on number three the thought process is is the market going to go up or is it going to go down that's as simple as that okay so is it going to go up or is it going to go down that's it right with cpa uh the thought process is okay uh you know let's say you're running at no let's just say you're doing it for free right so you still have your 135 dollars let's say you're doing it for free uh and your $135, well, no, I guess you may have to run an ad, but just for instance, if you were doing it for free, the thought process is, okay, uh, what offer, you know, am I going to, am I going to run? Um, and then what platforms, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, how much traffic, uh, am I going to need to, to, you know, get a good return, uh, and things like that. Right. And so, uh, how fast can I get a return? Okay. With CPA. Uh, if you're going to get a return on your investment, let's say you want to at least make $135, uh, that's going to be approximately, uh, matter of fact, let me exit out of this, guys. I'll raise this up and then we can go straight to, uh, we can go straight to the calculator, guys. Okay. So re real quick, uh, let's say, you know, you're running a CPA offer, right? $1.73. Okay. How long is it going to take you to make your money, right? And so this is the type of things that you have to factor in, guys. So let me go here, and I'll show you like this. $1.73, let's see, times 90 people, right? So we, let me go to, that's and that's actually to make a profit. So I'll just say, a dollar seventy three times one hundred people. Okay, so one hundred and seventy three dollars. Uh, for so roughly for you to make a, a profit, uh, you you'll need at least a hundred people to go through your landing page, right? When you're doing this CPA offer, guys, you will need at least a hundred people, one hundred people, guys. Okay, to go to your landing page, and so when we're talking about, you know the thought process and the effort, you're going to have to put in some effort, especially if you want to do free, because a lot of people don't want to do paid, which paid is the best way to do it. But with paid, like I said, you're going to be wasting money trying to figure out which campaign is going to work. 
And so, uh, it's gonna it's gonna take some some money to 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 try to figure that stuff out too at the beginning, and it's gonna take a lot of time uh, to try to figure out what's gonna work. Now, for instance, on the forex side, guys, uh, man, I <laughs> on the forex side, check this out. So, for instance, with that hundred and thirty five dollars, a platform like this, the reason why. I'm just going to go ahead and flat out and say it is that I think Forex is the best decision to go with first and foremost is because this is a six point six trillion dollar industry. And this is kind of where the rich people play. Right. This is Wall Street. I guess you can say uh, the foreign exchange market. I mean, money is traded here every day by by, by millionaires. Uh, and so, for instance, let me say if I did a 10 cent lot size, guys, and I wanted to, you know, Oh, well, so 10 cent is equivalent to $1 in the market, guys, right? And so I could even go as risky with the $100 that's doing 20 cents, okay? And so here's my thought process. This is what it looks like, okay? I see the market was going in an uptrend here. Then it did a reversal, maybe a reversal. Now it's headed in a downtrend. Okay, I woke up in the morning, and that's what I saw. Okay, so... I look at a couple other things. I see we had a shark out of the water here, you know, and then I see the market started to go up. So it's headed in the upward direction. Okay, well, I see a few other things. The market is in downward trend. I play sale. Boom. That's the thought process when I woke up. That's it, right? So let's say I place the sale here, right? And the market goes from here, and this is a 15-minute chart, so this happening in 15 minutes. So you could potentially make your money in 15 minutes, guys. So market jumps from here, uh, drops down to like around here, forms another candlestick. So within 30 minutes, and it keeps heading in the downward direction, within 30 minutes, I could have already made my $100, uh, over $100, right? Now, you could potentially lose that money if you don't know what you're doing as well. So for instance... Let me show you this. Let's say I placed a sale saying that the market was going to go down and it ended up going the opposite direction and it started going up, right? So I could place what we call a stop loss, right? So for instance, let's say here, I place a stop loss here. So I say, well, if the market decides to go in the opposite direction, I'm only, I'm only willing to lose, let's say, you know, uh, $10 or $5. So it comes up this way and it hits my stop loss and then I'll, I lost five dollars now versus something like CPA. You kind of have no control over that. <clears throat> you can pause and add, but you're kind of going to have to throw a, a few money, uh, a little bit of money out uh, and kind of run it for maybe two or three days uh, before you kind of find out what's going to work or not. So by that time, you're already out of, you know, maybe 20, 30 dollars if you're running five dollar ads on the split test. You're going to be out of, of that kind of money uh, fairly quickly, okay, as well. So both are risky, but I, I honestly think this would be a better uh, a better bang for your buck, to be completely honest, right? And so, like I said, how fast can I get a return? Typically with CPA, we're looking at, you know, you make, let's say you make, you do make $100, right? $150 or whatever, right? Uh you're going to have to wait around 30 days before you can get your money because typically most CPA networks are net 30 starting out. So you're going to wait 30 days before you can access your money. Well, Forex, I can access my money within two days, access my money within two days. I can with, I can make money, withdraw and have that money in my bank account. OK. And so, like I said, these are things that you're going to have to really factor into uh you know, once you're de depending on what you want to do. Now, like I said, the reason why I like Forex a lot better, to be honest, is because there's no recruiting, right? Besides the people who are doing IML, and I'm not in IML, I don't do the whole, you know, super recruiting game and trying to rank up and do MLMs. I don't do that. Uh, but besides that, those people, you know, uh, you can just sign up to traders way for free you can sign up to hugo's way for free you don't need anybody to to trade with 
you can do trading by yourself. And the reason why I call this like the silent six figure machine is because this is a skill set that you can do by yourself. You don't have to have, you know, anyone uh, trying to go through a landing page. Right. You don't have to have anyone doing any of that stuff. You just wake up, you see your chart, you place a trade, you make your money and you go back to sleep. guys. That's as simple as this. Or you pull out your phone, you make a trade, you make money and you go back to sleep. That's it. Like no one ever has to know what you do for a living. It's just kind of the silent six figure machine. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, but with CPA, you kind of, you know, got to convince people to, you know, hey, you know, who wants to get a, a gift card? You know, who wants to come through here and try to, you know, sp who wants to get a spend a target gift card? Or who wants to do you approve of Trump so far? Uh, people want to go through, <laughs> you get, you kind of get what I'm saying, guys, right? You got to kind of still low key convince people to go through these landing pages. And some people are just be, to be honest, some people are not good at recruiting and some people are just not good at driving traffic. But with Forex, there's no driving traffic. We don't have to worry about it, right? It's not, what's the best traffic source? It's okay. Is the market going to go up or down? That's it. That's it, guys. It's a lot of other things that factor into it, and I'm I'm, I'm making it sound as a lot easier, but it is it's really easy to be honest. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It's not hard, especially with this, the way that we teach it. Like I said, we have people that come in, and on their first day, they're they're making some profits, right? Now a lot of people are trading demo, but at the end of the day, they they're getting the skill set down, and I mean it's working. Like I said, and I'm not bashing CPA. CPA is great. I still do CPA. But my thing is as far as long term, as far as how much time, because think about this, guys, with CPA, you're going to be building landing pages. You have to find out if the landing page is a good landing page, if it's a bad landing page. And if it is bad, you have to find out, you know, uh, is the offer good? Because if you're running an ad to it, right, and then you're doing your split test, one of the one of the two things are going to happen. Either your landing page is going to be trash. Then you have to figure out, do I want to collect emails? If you don't want to collect emails, then you have to look at your offer and say, OK, it's not converting. So is it the landing page or is it my offer? Do I need to switch my offer? If you switch the offer, then it's like, OK, let me switch my landing page. Then you have to find out if that works. Right. And it's just kind of it kind of turns into a headache. And a lot of, you know, that's on my channel that are in that is, has been doing CPA and haven't made a lot of money or haven't made any money at all. You know how frustrating it is right now with something like forex to be honest this can be very frustrating too but it's as simple as is the market going to go up or is the market going to go down that's it at the end of the day like i said there's a lot more things you can factor into it but all in all that's the whole thought process the market's coming down now so is it going to go up in the next 15 minutes or is it going to continue to go down in the next 15 minutes? If I say it's going to go up, I click buy. If I say it's going to keep going down, I click sell. Once I'm in profit, I cash my money out. And that's it. I'm done for the day. I can go do whatever I want to do. Now, like I said, it's a lot different with CPA uh, when you're, you know, it's a lot more things you have to look at. And it's a lot, a lot of time that's going to be spent here because if you want to do, you know, um, free advertising you're gonna have to you know look at Facebook groups you're gonna have to be posting there manually you're gonna have to be on reddit you're gonna have to be posting there manually you're gonna have to be you know uh, posting statuses all the time trying to get people to go through with it you're gonna have to be building Instagram pages and try to build that niche out it's just a lot of it's a lot more that has to go along with it so that's kind of what I'm saying as far as that so let me kind of show you guys how far and I always go to my guy Q man this this is this is like my uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna say my mentor because I don't even really know the guy but I watched this guy grow man from a couple of years ago man when he didn't have any freaking money like I watched this guy grow from zero to being a, a freaking a millionaire you know what I'm saying with trading and he's buying you know McLaren's and all that stuff now I don't want you guys to get caught up in this uh, as far as the fancy cars and stuff like that. But I'm just saying that Forex has been changing people's lives. CPA, definitely too, right? So I'm not going to say either one. But let me go to one and just kind of show you 
uh, what you can do with something small, right? So, for instance, turn 50 cents into 13,000, okay? 50 cents into 13,000. When has that? When when could you ever do that with CPA marketing? Now this is not typical. This guy has been doing this for years. I'm just letting you know the potential if you master something, what the possibilities are. I'm not even doing these kind of numbers yet. You know what I mean? I'm doing great numbers. Like the most I've made in a day was around like three thousand. Okay, but that's still three thousand in one day. I've never done three thousand in one day with CPA. I've done around a thousand. You know, but then again, I did a lot of manual labor versus me putting in buy or sell and making three thousand dollars. You guys kind of get what I'm saying. And so that's what I'm saying. So understand that if you guys you guys can follow this guy. I mean, he he, he does amazing stuff. Now, when I if you want to try to join this guy, you're going to pay an arm and a leg. So. Depending on if you want to invest that kind of money, I'm just going to be completely honest with you. If you come here to his page and you're like, hey, I want to join this guy to see what he's doing, you're going to pay an arm and a leg. I'm just going to keep it 100. Is it worth it? I don't know because I don't have it. But as you can see, for a five-day in-person course, he'll do 1200 A main course, $749. Five-day online course, $1,100. Versus joining our team for $50 one time. You know what I'm saying? Kind of is a no-brainer. So, uh, but like I said, this guy's a beast. He's a great person to follow uh, when it comes to to, to forex. Uh, he, he he kills it. You know what I mean? And like I said, turning something small into something uh, great all the time. And I'm trying to see if I can find a, another one with an even smaller one. Uh, let's see. Oh, for instance, bingo. <clears throat> so right here, guys, 20 cent. Remember that 20 cent I was talking about? Remember that 20 cent? Let's so say you had $100 in your account. <laughs> now, like I said, this is not typical. So I don't want you to think you can just do this all the time. It's not. I mean, you have to know what you're doing. But 20 cent, he probably let this trade ride for like two or three days. Right. But 20 cent for off of your $100. Imagine that. You getting in at the right time, the right moment, right? And you, like I say, he lost, as you can see, $3. He lost this, lost this, lost this, and he lost this. But then he came back with these big numbers off of $0.20 cent and still made $4,000. So you can see you can lose, but you can also win big. But I'm saying if you learn a skill, guys you can make some really good money. So with that being said, my recommendation would be uh, Forex. I love CPA as well, but as far as $135 investment, I would say as far as how much time is going to take me to learn something, how much effort, the thought process, how fast I can get a return, long-term goal, I would, I would go with Forex. Okay. Now, I wouldn't say stop doing CPA. I would actually say do both, to be honest. But as far as just that 135, yeah, I'm going to go with Forex. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hopefully I helped you uh, understand. Uh, if you have any comments, concerns, or whatever, comment below. Like I said, they're both great platforms. You can make good money with both. But that's just kind of how I would do it. Uh, but hey. You kind of do what you want, you know? But other than that, my Instagram's below. My text messages are below. Oh, one quick thing, guys. Like I said, I do have my Forex course. That's $50 one time, right? Uh, and then I do have my CPA course. That's $50 one time. You know, uh, that's going to go until Thanksgiving. So, uh, and then last, I, w I am dropping the one-on-one -on -one coaching course from five hundred dollars to three fifty until Thanksgiving as well, guys. So if, I know a lot of you've been asking me about the one on one. Uh, a lot of people who have the one on one with me have been loving it. Uh, like I said, the one on one is pretty much we meet online, uh, whether Instagram we do the face to FaceTime or whatever, 
uh, and I kind of just walk you through whatever it is you want to learn, whether it's affiliate marketing, Forex, CP, I kind of walk you through the processes uh, and all that kind of stuff. So that's the one on one. I'll have all that stuff in the description below. But all my information is below, guys. Contact me about anything. If you need just help, training, whatever, I'll help you guys out. Other than that, I will see you guys in another video. Peace.